Wait, what? We hit start recording? Oh, no. Okay, anyways. Hey, everybody. Dark Prince Plays here. Letting the curtains rise on another episode of my Let's Play of Super Mario 64. In the last episode, we got the secret star from the stupid bonus level over there. We got the 100 coin star at Rainbow Ride and got one other star, too. This time, we're going to be heading back in to get more stars. So if you haven't seen the previous episodes, so make sure the before watching this until you're caught up with everything that's happened up to this point. Now that we've done that, we can just... We, um... Oh god. We can just go through this level normally. Hooray! So I don't need those coins really anymore. It's just smooth sailing from here. Plus fire. Okay, when are you gonna start? Oh god, okay. Oh wow, okay, barely got that. <laughs> Try to kaizo me, huh? Well, it's not gonna work. At least not there and at that time. So, yeah. Mama, mama, mia, 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 mama, mia, mama, I'm a mama, mama, Mario, no, mama Luigi. I don't know what I was doing there. Oh, oh god, okay. That would have been terrible. I think I had a trick for this. I did. And maybe this one, did it for this one too? I don't remember. Not like that, but you know what? It still brought me up here, so I'm not complaining. Okay, I don't have any reason to jump off the carpet this time, so I'll actually be able to go to the top, hopefully. Unless something stupid happens. And as you saw last time, the furnace just blasts fire nor or randomly. So that's fun. Whoa, I felt that barely, like, like Mars overalls probably like got super warm for a second. Almost got cooked. I say like that, like cooked. Like a, my throat made like a weird like clicking noise for some reason. Okay, so there were coins here, but how many exactly? So there are those five. Oh, there's five over here. No, that's... Yeah, it's five. Okay. I, why did I think it was six? Okay, yeah, it dips down, like, right into the furnace. But luckily it just burned. Actually... Okay. So there's 15 coins, because I don't feel like grabbing those ones on the table, because I'd rather get to the top of this place. What's in here? The one up, which just left. I don't know. Oh well. 94 stars. We're nearing the triple digits. Okay. So we continue. I'm gonna go for two more stars here. Coins amazed and amazed. Okay. Yeah, you already saw that I'm capable of getting these red coins, so... In theory, this shouldn't be that hard, but knowing me, it's gonna be very difficult. Like YouTube really has nothing better to do, huh? Well, they can't go like host Mario Kart or something. Which, by the way, I th no, I think Super Mario Kart was before this, right? I'm too lazy to check again right now. 
I'm I'm pretty sure Mario 64 was before Mario Kart 64 cuz this game was a launch title. Whoa. What? What happened there? I don't know how I did that, but you know what? Just, again, another one of those victories that we just say, you know what, I'll take it. Okay. Oh, I guess I got three coins. I was gonna say, how did I end up with an odd number of coins? And <laughs> here we go! <laughs> Like Mario's in a Michael Bay movie. 95. Was that the year this came from? I, was it 95? Swinging in the breeze. I know that's when Pokemon started. Or no. No, that was 96. I'm done. I'm feeling really tired right now. Wasn't it 1996? I know that's when Toy Story came out. 95. Or am I just being insane and like thinking completely wrong right now? And is Pokemon actually 95? At like right now, like I, again, I'm still very tired. This is the same recording session, and we. I was like, like, my brain just doesn't want to think of any facts like that. Or think about any facts like that right now. But you know what? I say otherwise. To that, I say nay. Okay, I'm, I'm checking this now. It's going to make me angry if I don't. That's not right. Okay, it was 96. Okay. So I'm not crazy. Well, I am, but not really. It's, for some reason, Google told me 98, and I was like, no, that that's not at all correct. Even I, like, even me, like, right now, who's, like, who feels really drained, knows for a fact that that is not correct. Aw, oh, man, I forgot about my Chick-fil-A in the fridge. I ate Hot Pockets instead when I go, oh, no. Oh, thank God. The game did decide to just launch me forward with my dive. Would I? No, I would not have landed on anything except die. By the way, if you made it this far in the video, comment down below what your favorite fast food place is. For me, I'd say Chick-fil-A is like one of my favorite. Probably my favorite, I'm not sure. Um, two more stars, okay. I'll leave those for later. Yeah, for me, I'd say Chick-fil-A is one of the best also. Um, I'm pretty sure that this next one's like a an East, no, West Coast thing. Sorry, not East. It's a West Coast exclusive. It's called In-N-Out. I don't know how many of you have heard of that, but they like still they make burgers. It's honestly like really simple burgers. It's not like nothing too crazy. Uh, by the way, where am I going first? Um, am I am I doing Wom's Fortress? Okay, I guess we're going back to Wom's Fortress. Um, but they make really good burgers in my opinion, and their fries are really good too. Like they're pretty salty, but like I feel like it's like a really good amount of salt. For me, at least. Shoot into the wild blue. I remember this one. It's been a while since we've been here, huh? But yeah, um, I would say that, in my opinion, um, In-N-Out makes the best burgers, or at least for me, they make the best tasting burgers. And then Chick-fil-A makes the best chicken. I do love me some KFC and Popeyes. And, like, I also do like Jack-in-the-Box and Wendy's. 
I think I want to hit that pillar over there. Um, but that's just... Oh, boy! Wrong, wrong spot. Yeah, and that's just my opinion. Don't, like, go down and flame me in the comments. Say, like, oh, your opinion sucks. McDonald's is the best. Like, opinions are valid. You can share yours. Just don't be a huge jerk about it. And we'll be cool. But also, speaking of exclusives, like coast exclusives, I remember. Whoa, back when I was on there, back when I was on vacation, which was like back when um, Captain Toad Treasure Tracker was like on a week long hiatus. Um, I was in North Carolina and Washington D.C. Falling to the Cage Diamond. Oh wait, we get to show off the owl finally. Okay, but um, oh, I forgot to look up something. Uh, for the next star, shoot. Because there was actually something I wanted to show off. Let's see if I can pull, like, actually perform it properly. But, um. Oh, wait. Let me let me show off the owl and then I'll continue the story. So, you just climb up the tree. Look at that little guy. Who's there? Who's there? Who woke No, who's there? Who woke me up? There's a fly near the mic. Okay. It's still daylight. I should be sleeping. Hey, as long as I'm awake, why not take a short flight with me? Press and hold B to grab on, release B to let go. I'll take you wherever you want to go, just as long as my wings hold out. Watch my shadow and grab on. So yeah, he'll pretty much take you to the top of the level. Up, oh, no, come back. Come back. So yeah, take you up here. Uh, he is definitely different than um, Mario 64 DS, because I get, oh no. So it even makes like, his own music and he does flap uh slower uh in ds where'd he go is he gone nope okay but um when i was in north carolina i saw a commercial like before i was heading to sleep i was like usually me and my family like leave the tv on overnight and I happened to be, like, watching a commercial, and it was, like, some, like, it, I think it was, like, fries or tater tots, but it had, like, bacon and mac and cheese or something. It was, like, something that really appealed to me. And I was, like, oh, that looks, that looks delicious. Where can I get that? And it was, like, it's, like, Zaxby's. I'm, like, what's Zaxby's? I've never heard of that in my life. And then I was, like, oh, that, that stupid fly. Go away. Okay. Um, I was, like, oh, yeah, I'm stupid. I forgot. Can this fly leave me alone? I have a file of restraining order against this insect. <laughs> it's like an alternate plot for the B movie, but uh. <laughs> yeah, and then I was like, oh yeah, I'm dumb, I forgot. There's like area exclusive restaurants and such. So yeah, some of you might not have heard, in, like, some of you who were watching this might have. Never heard of In N Out, but like know Zaxby's really well. And some of you watching, because I know I've like checked my like analytics on YouTube, and apparently, um, like, okay, I already, like most of my viewers are from the U.S. like by a lot. For a while, my second most like, um, what is it, um. I'm trying to think. Um, the place where I got my my second most amount of views from was like Japan, which is really cool. Um, but now it's the UK. Uh, can you die, please? The heck! This guy's trouble dying. Oh, well, fine. Have it your way then. Yeah, that's just something I wanted to share. Now, I'm, I'm just going to heal and then pause the recording because I actually wanted to try something. Oops. Alright, cool. Now I'll be right back because I... Actually, no, I'll go up here and then I'll be right back because I want to see how to pull this off. And how can I climb up there? Every time I tried like, to grab onto the side of a slope, it just kicked me off. Okay. 
I'll be right back. I'm gonna pretend I understood that. Okay, let's try it. Knowing me, I am not gonna get this at all. Hence my very awesome attempt at that. No, oh, you screw off, please. Okay, so it has to do with this plank. I'm pretty sure you can do this because Isaiah showed me um, how he did it. I don't know if I'm doing the stop waking up go back to sleep I don't know if I'm doing the easy way or the hard way oh come off how am I even gonna do this if I can't even grab onto the ledge properly yeah okay once I grab onto the ledge I'm only trying it once maybe maybe bonus material if oh god Okay, go up, stationary, backflip. Oh my god, I actually did it! <laughs> 99 stars, apparently. So that was cannonless. I got that on recording, too. I didn't think I was going to do that. Okay, actually... All right, I'm gonna go back in and do that legitimately. But I want to explain what I just did. Because I, I was like kind of trying to focus to see if I could do it at all. Technically that was on the first try too because like all those other ones I just kept missing the ledge. So what you gotta do, you gotta jump, um, grab as close like, you have to grab the ledge as close to the right side of the plank as possible. Grab, like, climb up, stay still, do a backflip, punch once, go down the, like, ledge grab, then go, like, right, left. Mario will jump up, and then he'll do, like, a semicircle and then jump off. And I guess he'll get the star somehow inside the wall. That was really cool. I didn't think I was going to get that. And I'm sure a lot of you didn't think either. Well, we were both surprised, I suppose. Okay, but this is how you're supposed to do it. Now that I showed up, that neat trick. So you gotta shoot into the wall. And take damage in the process, I suppose. So, break it. Oops. Yeah, it's right there. Wow. I su greatly surprised myself. Okay, I'm not going to go for the 100 coin star at Jolly Roger Bay yet. So I, yeah. So I got everything at Baba Battlefield and Wamp's Fortress now. Now I just got to go to Jolly Roger Bay. So I'm not going to get the 100 coins there yet. I'll save that for the beginning of next episode. But I at least want to get a star. What's the next one? Red coins on the ship afloat. Okay. Nope. Oh, actually? Oh, I got that one already. Um. Actually, no. I'm gonna not do that because I might as well like also try to get the 100 coin star while doing that. So. That's a no-go for me for now. But, now that we have the metal cap, which we didn't have last time we were here, we can sink to the bottom and grab that star that we couldn't before. We Honestly, I feel like him falling this slow is a blessing in disguise, because... Oh, wait, you might also want to go, like, right under the step. Well, thanks. I was gonna say him falling slowly is a maybe is a bless a ble blessing in disguise because that'll extend the video length and warrant me ending the episode off after I get this. Yeah, now it's definitely reasonable for me to just end off the episode. Thank you. 
Oh god. Okay, can you go faster? We gonna... Got it! Okay. Star number 100. That just leaves 20 more. How many secret stars am I missing, actually? Hold on. So... That's... Two... Four, so it's six... Seven... Nine... Ten... Twelve... Thirteen... Fourteen... Fifteen... Seventeen... So... Um... And then eighteen. So I think I'm missing... Oh, no, wait, I think, um, the red coins in Bowser's level counts as a castle secret star. So I think I'm missing two secret stars. I'll have to look to see which ones I'm missing. But I'd say I'm pretty well set on my, um, on my star count right now. So all I really need to do, find those last two hidden stars, or secret stars, gather the stars I didn't grab while in each of the levels, and get the red coins in the final level, then beat Bowser, and then I'm done. It sounds as easy as one, two, three, but it's really not. But anyways, next time on Super Mario 64, we'll be getting the 100 coin star in Jolly Roger Bay, as well as the red coin star, so that way we'll be able to finish it off. So I'll see you guys in the next one. And... Oops. Goodbye!